Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Today, we're diving into some fascinating developments in military technology. We're talking about the RQ-180, a stealthy new drone that could reshape U.S. intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance strategies. Buckle up as we explore the details of this cutting-edge aircraft and what it means for global defense. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more incredible stories of triumph, dedication, and achievement. Share this video with your friends and family to spread the inspiration and let's continue to support our heroes who make our nation proud. The U.S. Air Force is hinting at a significant shift in its ISR, intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, strategy. Recently, Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall discussed future ISR platforms, pointing towards advanced technologies like space-based assets and next-generation drones. Among these, the Northrop Grumman RQ-180, often called the White Bat, stands out as a key player. The RQ-180 is a high-altitude, long-endurance, hail, drone designed for contested airspace. Developed under a classified budget, it started low-rate production in 2013. This drone is an advanced version of the RQ-170 Sentinel and is expected to be equipped with cutting-edge stealth features, enhanced endurance, and capabilities for electronic attacks. The RQ-180 is believed to have a cranked kite design with a wingspan of about 130 feet. Its stealth capabilities are reportedly superior to previous models like the F-117 and F-22, making it ideal for penetrating sophisticated air defenses. The drone's stealth features and long-range position it as a counter to advanced air defense systems developed by adversaries like China and Russia. Interestingly, the existence of the RQ-180 has been indirectly confirmed through the establishment of the 74th Reconnaissance Squadron at Beale Air Force Base, which operates the drone. The squadron's insignia features a white bat, aligning with the drone's nicknames, Great White Bat and Shikaka. Recent developments, including U.S. drone losses in Yemen and increased threats from air defenses, underscore the need for such advanced platforms. The RQ-180 could play a crucial role in enhancing ISR capabilities, particularly for allies like the Philippines, by supporting their military efforts and improving their defense strategies in contested regions like the South China Sea. So, what do you think about the RQ-180 and its potential impact on modern warfare? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on the latest in military technology, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.